Hey friends, this is Atif Hope here. Well and welcome to the new update on Algorand Coin. In my last video, we were watching that Algorand was about to test the support of a big wedge. Right now, after testing the support, we are again reaching this resistance of the wedge. And in today's video, we will take a look whether Algorand will be able to break out this resistance or not. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more ideas, you can also support me at the Patreon because here I am sharing different trading ideas for you and you can find the link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. So let's start the analysis. First of all, let me to uh, recall this very big uh, bullish harmonic reversal uh, cipher pattern. Sorry, this is the shark pattern uh, that has been formed on the weekly time frame chart. And here we had a very, very strong support. Therefore, I've defined my buying uh, at maximum up to 67 cents and I'll t tell you and show you how we have very 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 strong support here and I'm not going for a 1.13 Fibonacci retracement level and I'm not expecting that move as well now uh, the, after the reversal we can expect the sell targets here at $1.68 uh, $1 and goes to $2.50 and this was the chart by the way I shared for my members at the Patreon on 23rd of January now, after playing the chart, we can see that the price line is still moving in this buying zone. Now, if we take a look at this uh, daily time frame, then here price line uh, is recently bounced by the support and going towards the resistance of this falling wedge pattern. We also have very strong support. Another resistance here, uh, the, exactly where we have the resistance of this falling wedge. Uh, this red line that is exponential moving average 21 on the daily time frame if i remo remove this resistance this this trend line from here then you can see exactly at the same level this red line we have that is the ema 21. so the price line needs to break out both resistance levels together the ema 21 and also the resistance of this falling wedge pattern in order to start a big move from here. And I would like to repeat it again that even though we have a very big harmonic bullish reversal pattern formed on the weekly time frame, but in order to be safe, we can also wait for this breakout and then we can buy, even though we are moving in the buying zone of this uh, potential reversal zone of this uh, cipher, uh, this chart move, but we can wait for this breakout as well. Now, if we take a look at the weekly time frame, and this was the support I was telling you that why I defined my buying zone maximum up to 67 cents, you can see on the weekly time frame. This 67 cents support has been breaking as a very, very strong support and resistance at the different places. Like here, it has been breaking as a strong resistance, and here it worked as a support on the weekly time frame, here as well, and here as well. And same as like these three spikes, we are having another spike. And you can see after every spike, it is starting the next rally, sometime the shorter rally, sometime the long rally. This time we can expect that after testing the support, we can have another reversal from here. So this was the update so far. I hope that you have liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more ideas, you can also support me here at the Patreon because here I am sharing different trading ideas for you. And you can find the link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.